Well, hello and welcome into a special edition of Bronco Chat. We're going to take a look inside the Stephen C. and Patricia A. Shot Athletic Excellence Center today. I'm David Gentili with Bronco Athletics, joined by the Director of Athletics, Dr. Renee Baumgartner. And wow, this is an exciting time. We're coming down the home stretch, all the planning, construction's going on. How excited are you for the stage we're at right now? You know, David, I am super thrilled. I think every day I walk by that facility and I think, wow, this dream has become a reality because there's so many incredible Broncos that have gotten us to this point today. You know, I want to thank DevCon and Gary Filizetti for getting this building open in mid-September. And then we just had so many people that have um, given their time and their treasure to make this dream become a reality. So many people have been involved with this building, so there is a lot to be grateful for on that front. All right, let's head inside the Shot Athletic Excellence Center. First up, it's the DeGary and Locatelli Lobby. I love walking into this building. The lobby is incredible. You're gonna see a huge video board on the right, and if you turn to the left, you're gonna see our donor wall that has many, many names of some incredible people that have given to this building. And you see all of that just steps into the building. Over to the right, two more things to show you here. First up, the legendary coach's wall. This concept became a reality thanks to John and Julia Torrey, and it's sponsored by Heritage Bank, thanks to Walt Kasberic. We've also got the Bill and Pamela Connolly fuel station. So some great visuals right off the bat to get you inspired as you step foot in this building. And we're just super excited about this complete care center for our student athletes. And I feel like when they walk in, that magic is just going to overcome them in a sense that, wow, you know, we have this new building, we have a new weight room, treatment center, academic center, as well as um, two gyms. And I think that it's gonna be a great place for our student athletes to congregate and hang out and really um, reach their academic and athletic excellence. From the main lobby, little veer to the left and you're in the Bronco Bench Foundation Sports Performance Center. I love this Bronco Bench Foundation Sports Performance Center because we can have more than one team in the weight room now. And, you know, it's a beautiful facility, brand new weight room equipment, um, you know, exercise machines. Um, we have offices for our coaches and it just sets the stage and the tone for giving our student athletes an incredible opportunity to work to the best of their ability, have the equipment they need. And we're really excited about just having a bunch of teams be able to work out at the same time for class scheduling. It's really important. And so um, this 10,000 square foot facility is a game changer for us as well. And in some of those shots, you can see the entrances to the two practice courts named after legendary men's basketball coaches, Carol Williams and Dick Davey. Yeah, I'm so excited about the courts being named after these two incredible basketball coaches who are very intricately involved in Santa Clara athletics right now. And as you can see, um, the magnitude of these gyms and the opportunity for them to have our basketballs and our volleyball teams uh, practice in those facilities. And in the Davy Court, we're gonna allow our students with intramurals and rec uh, use that facility as well. And we're also gonna host Bronco Bash events, um, university dinners potentially, uh, you know, we're going to have the preview days with admissions, having future Broncos want to come in there and just um, show off our incredible facility. All right, that's the first floor. Let's head up to the second floor and take a look at the Stevens Academic Center. I love this academic center because when we talk to our student athletes about how they like to learn, they all learn in different ways. And so they're able to study outside in a lobby. Um, go inside the Stevens Academic Center and it has small uh, group rooms, larger group rooms, and it's going to just be an incredible place for all of our student athletes to be able to come in, get the academic support they need, and really continue to thrive in the, in the classroom. And right around the corner is the Sports Medicine Center. The Sports Medicine Center is absolutely breathtaking in the fact that we have hot and cold pools and an underwater treadmill. Uh, we don't have to get in the tin, uh, cold and hot pools anymore. And we're actually going to have more tables than we've ever had. And so our student athletes won't have to wait in line. And they're really going to have a chance to go in and get evaluated, have a space and an opportunity to get their rehabilitation done and get out as soon as possible so they can get back on the court or, you know, on the field or even um, in the water. So I'm super um, thrilled about how that has turned out. The space of that is incredible. 
And I think that our student athletes will really appreciate, um, you know, when it's a hard time to have a place to go in that can really uh, take great care of them and get them out as soon as possible. Well, very cool to see those shots inside the building and very cool to see the progress and certainly excited for the opening here in a very, very short amount of time. But that's not all we've got for you today. One more surprise. If you've been on or around campus, you might have seen it. But on the Tennis Center side, loud and proud, big Broncos branding facing those tennis courts. You know, our tennis coaches are thrilled that we have, you know, our six courts that really look like a nice enclosed um, opportunity for them to compete. You throw a brand new scoreboard up there, thanks to Christine Zanello and the big Broncos, um, you know, and as our students come to games, they're able to walk by and see the Broncos on the wall. And it's just a great way to kind of finish that stadium, that tennis fill. And I'm really excited just about how we branded this building. And I can't wait to have that sneak peek with um, all of your uh, fans that are watching this today. We will be able to give you clips of the fun things that we're doing um, in the Shot Athletic Excellence Center as well. Well, when I hear you talk about this building, game changer is a common phrase that comes up. Now that we've seen the interior, tell us why this is a game changing building. I have said game changer over and over again because I understand the impact that a facility like this can have on a university. And seeing the uh, look on some of our coaches who have been able to go through the building spaces as well as some of our staff, they're really impressed and can't even believe that this dream has become a reality. And for me, I know that when our student athletes come back to campus, they're gonna be so excited about having a place to be together, to work out, and really have a chance to um, you know, accomplish their goals and dreams. And the way I look at this is Santa Clara Athletics and Santa Clara University is special because we build mind, body, and spirit. And that's exactly what the Stephen C. and Patricia A. Schott Athletic Excellence Center is going to do for our student athletes. Santa Clara's Director of Athletics, Dr. Renee Baumgartner, and playing tour guide for us as well today. Thanks so much for your time and showing us through the building. Thank you, David, and go Broncos. Thanks everyone for watching. To keep up with the latest on the Shot Athletic Excellence Center and in Santa Clara Athletics on the whole, go to SantaClaraBroncos.com and look for the social media handles at SCU Broncos. Thanks for watching.